So the other day I had shared um, a message about the kind of, you know, journey that I've had so far in terms of education and single parenthood and the kind of like stigma in, you know, Somali society associated with, you know, my past life experiences of being a young unwed mother. And, you know, the comments were really sweet and nice and I really appreciate that. What I do wonder about it though, in retrospect, it's it's nice to say and congratulate someone like, hey, you did a great job. Um, you know, you've um, succeeded in your life, you've triumphed. And I'm like, that's that's great, thank you very much. But what I'm concerned with a lot of times is the people that are in that situation right now. There are people that we know um, are shunned in our family, are not considered parts of our family, are in complete like isolation or socially isolated from the family because of you know the current life experiences that they have. And those are the people that really need your words of encouragement and your love and support right now. They really need it for them to be able to see a light at the end of the tunnel. So my, you know, thing is, thank you. I appreciate your comments to me. But for all intents and purposes, you know, I'm in a good place, but I needed that reassurance and support uh, before. And there's someone right now that needs it. So call up that family member that's shunned in your family, that's not considered part of the family and tell them, you know, you love them and you support them. That will go a long way. Thank you.